There are two different methods of toe and healing, depending on whether your warm core doors have been supplied with a toe and healing device. Before toe and healing, adjust the bogey wheels as needed to level out any gaps between the sash and head. Start toe and healing by packing from the bottom corner of the bogey wheel to the diagonally opposite top corner with bridge packers. You always want to pack from the bottom of the bogey wheel so the adjacent sash will be a mirror image. If you have a toe and healing device, stick a packer to the device using the adhesive strip so the metal doesn't come into direct contact with the glass. If you don't have a toe and healing device, apply a bridge packer here instead using a bead of silicon to hold it in place. You can use silicon to hold the other bridge packers in place if required. Apply another packer onto the bottom bridging packer either before or after adding the glass unit. It's important that you add packers over each of the bridge packers once the glass unit has been inserted and pack carefully around the hinge and lock points to prevent damage. Be careful not to overpack the sashes as this can cause swelling. If you have a toe and healing device you can tighten this as needed but be careful not to over tighten as this can cause damage to the glass unit. Pack one glazing unit at a time and fix the beads correctly before progressing onto the next sash. If you are toe and healing a door which opens from the centre, you should pack the opening sash last.